everything's been so so easy for me uh, to come in as a new guy. You know, the team is great, staff is great, facilities are great. When I speak English and say my name, I also pronounce it wrong, but let me try. It's uh, Jere Uronen. No, no, nothing, nothing. Uh, first of all, to, to feel the atmosphere at the, at the home stadium. Uh, I mean, been watching so many games. Games of Schalke uh, throughout the years, uh, so many games of Bundesliga, I know that the atmosphere here is, is like nowhere else. So uh, just experience this, you know, get the goosebumps, get the smile and just fight for the, fight for the club. Calm. Uh, bad sense of humor. And social. Literally everything, uh, mostly early 2000 R&B, hip hop, the old school classics that I grew up with. But uh, I find a good song from every every genre. Probably Usher, I would say. Uh, yeah, his his songs from the early 2000 are fantastic. Normally oatmeal. Uh, not a big breakfast guy, uh, but I know I have to eat because we have training, so something that it's easy to eat. I like to take a hot shower a uh, few hours, an hour before we leave to the stadium, just to, you know, uh, think about the game, think about what I want to do and just kind of kind of get the last relaxation before, uh, before it's time to go war. Not at all. Never really been a big fan of FIFA. Uh, been playing PlayStation, but not uh, just not not FIFA. My home city in Finland, Turku. Uh, home sweet home. Nothing nothing can beat home. Yeah, yeah, I do actually. Uh, um, we normally both cook with my wife, uh, and it's it's kind of like a hobby together. So yeah, I love it. Elon Musk, maybe, because his, uh, his brain has generated uh, quite a fortune for himself. He, he's a smart man, so just get a little bit of that smartness in me. In football, that's a good question. I really like Patrice Evra after I started uh, playing, playing on my left back position, so the early years were definitely him. I think it was in Croatia, in Dubrovnik, for, for a couple of days. Uh, but it's been a while. Covid, uh, two kids, so it's been too long. These rules change constantly, so maybe this has changed already. But for defenders, the handball in the, in the penalty area, uh, if you make a slight tackle and it touches the backhand or, or if someone just shoots you at the hand, you know, it's impossible to react because uh, yeah, it's for a defender, it's so difficult. I know handball is a handball, but sometimes, you know, maybe it's changed already. I have no idea. <laughs> treat others like you wish they would treat you. Uh, that's that's for me always been uh, one of the one of the main things uh, I, I try to think about. The attitude, I think. Uh, uh, also, also thinking, uh, thinking, trying to be one step ahead, uh, trying to win situations before they happen. Uh, I would, I would, uh, I would say that. Rye bread. Uh, to be honest, I haven't been in grocery stores here, but uh, really dark rye bread. Uh, it's something that we always bring with the with us from Finland when we go there. Put it, put them in the freezer, and then uh, then we can enjoy them. Kids, <laughs> kids are my hobby nowadays. <laughs>